In the Canyon Country Village, you can find one of the city's most iconic landmarks. Familiar to almost all, this white clock tower has been in our town for years. So imagine what the residents were feeling when they came to find their clock tower was surrounded by a fence. One of the groups that was largely affected by the demolition was the realty executives, whose building has been torn down. Last week I was reading on Facebook and it was torn down and it's like, it just actually it just kind of hit me and I didn't expect to have that kind of reaction. Although Felicia no longer has her office, she's still in high spirits that the clock tower is still up. It's an icon! It's an icon and every time we'd have like some crazy 118 degree weather, the news crews would be here. There it is, you know, because you can see it. If it's really cold, there it is. And it was, it's just part of our community. With support coming from all over the town to keep the clock tower, City Hall has had no choice but to listen to its residents. We wanted to make sure that we were able to keep that, uh, that tower there. Uh, we knew that the, the community would be upset if, uh, if it was lost or uh, demolished. With the ordinance in place to protect our clock building and little TLC promise, the question must be asked, What's next for a lost building? And the answer just might shock you. Yep, you guessed it. The clock tower will now have a Starbucks next to it. And residents seem to be excited. You know, honestly, it feels really good knowing that there's going to be another Starbucks to the town. It's a really good place to come and study and chill with your friends. And just, it can really just be a good hangout spot. And honestly, them adding more Starbucks in, in the town has never been a problem with me. Honestly, the more, the merrier. So I'm glad to see it. With the clock tower saved and the new Starbucks on the way, the Santa Clarita Valley's future is looking bright. For Canyons News, I'm Darius Burko.